Hey guys, welcome to your love reading for um, Libra. This is going to be for October 2023. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. So we are going to take a look and see uh, what's going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with. And then we will take a look at your person to see what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read with the outcome and advice and what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on. So apply this to your own unique situation, all right? You may switch the roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Libra people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok and also on Instagram, the links for those are in the description box below. I do also post readings on there too, okay? So tell me about Libra. Libra and love and the person that they are connecting with. What's going on with Libra and love and the person that they are connecting with for um, October 2023? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Libra, for Libra here. All right, we have the Sun and the Eight of Cups. Libra, it could be a situation that you walked away from a situation and now you're realizing that, you know, maybe, you know, it was tough to walk away, but I feel like you're happier than you were before. Yeah, I feel like you were happier than you were before. With the Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and the Two of Wands. So I feel like there was someone here that you really cared about and that you really loved or that you still love this person. Maybe you love this person in a way that you want good things for them in their, in their life. But I feel like this was a tough decision. But I feel like this was, a, this was the best decision here for you with the Page of Wands here in the Tower. I feel like almost like with the Tower card here in the Page of Wands, I feel like this person's definitely losing their losing losing their marbles over you. However, this is, I feel like this person does not want me to leave. You definitely distanced yourself from somebody here. Um, Libra with the King of Wands here and the uh, and the Hermit Virgo energy because I feel like this person has really hurt you here. This is interesting because I feel like this person is not really empathetic about how they use their words here because I feel like this person I mean I do feel like it's important to be direct and honest and transparent but it's the way that you deliver you know it's the de delivery and I feel like this person has a very harsh delivery here comes off really mean and I feel like you're really sensitive here uh Libra so I'm with the Queen of Cups why is the Queen of Cups here Queen of Cups and the Six of Swords Two of Wands and the Page of Pentacles this is someone from your past here that's definitely watching you and spying on you could be dealing with someone here that's younger than you doesn't have to be it could be that this person's really immature but they can't move on from you here you're definitely moving on to towards new, something new here or that you're just focusing on your happiness at this time here, Libra. Yeah, whoever this is, I feel like this person's missing you a lot. This person's definitely spying on you, watching you to see what what you're doing, see if you moved on to a new, new relationship. Um, tell me about the person that Libra is dealing with here. What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Libra? What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Libra for um, October 2023? Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for Libra, for Libra. Knight of Wands and the Ten of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy. This person's been really inconsistent, very in and out of your life. I feel like this person has very poor impulse control. I do feel like this person still cares, does care about you and love you, but I feel like this person cannot control themselves. I feel like this person, it's almost, I don't know, it almost comes off that this person has a bit, I don't know. It seems like this, I feel like this person has a bit of Tourette's or something like that, you know, kind of like a mild case of it. We have the Seven of Wands here and the Chariot, Cancer Energy. Yeah, it seems like they want to make peace here with you. They want to uh, commit to you or that they want to make you some promises here. Uh, one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like this person struggles with like, I don't know, it's almost like some this person spazzes out. And I feel like it, uh, I, I feel like this person cannot really explain what it is or this person doesn't understand it. I do feel like this person has to like... 
I do feel like this person needs some sort of help here. Yeah, needs some sort of help here. I'm not quite sure, but it's, it seems like maybe this person deals with some sort of mental health. I feel like if it's, if it's not mental health, it's some sort of like tick that this person has. It's like, I feel like this person can, just has like poor impulse control, cannot control themselves here. We have the Three of Swords and the Strength card. We have the Lovers and the Ace of Wands here. Whoever this is, I feel like this person feels badly for hurting you. But I almost get the sense that this person cannot control themselves. Yeah, I mean, this person might have cheated on you here too, but I feel like this person knew that it was wrong, but they did it anyway here with the Sun of Wands and the Five of Swords. We have the Chariot here and the Emperor Aries energy. You know, I feel like this person's trying to do everything that they can to win you back. They're trying to prove to you that they've changed here, Libra. They definitely want a new beginning. They want a new start here. They want to move towards a future here with you. Yeah, this person's in love with you. I feel like whoever this is, if you're in no contact with this person, I feel like they're about to break no contact here with you. Um, tell me about the outcome and advice here for Libra regarding their love situation. What else does Libra need to know, look out for, work on for um, October 2023, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. We have the King of Pentacles. We have the Ten of Pentacles. This person's serious about committing to you here. This person is serious about showing you that they've changed. We have the Empress here in the Knight of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. We have the Empress of the Empress here. We have the Page of Cups and the Nine of Swords. They want to make things right here with you. The problem is I feel like this person's worried that they're going to drop the ball again. Yeah, this person's anxious, nervous, scared that they will ruin things again here with you. Nine of Swords and the Six of Wands. Page of Cups. And the Magician here, Gemini Virgo, I feel like this person's trying everything in their power to not mess this up again. Knight of Swords and the Ten of Cups. Yeah, this person wants this person wants this really badly here with you. With the Empress and the Seven of Swords, I feel like you've been lied to by, by this person. I feel like you've been cheated on. And I feel like right now you're in self-preservation energy here. Yeah, this person wants this really, 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 really badly. We have the King of Wands here and the Four of Wands. This is a strong twin flame connection or a strong soul tie. You just know that this is going to go down in flames here. And that, you know, with the Nine of Pentacles here and the Judgment, you're just realizing that you're better off right now on your own and just ending this connection with this person here and moving on. Because there's, you, you realize that there's nothing for you here. I feel like that's why you walked away. Even though this was a tough situation, you're like, you know what? Even though this is a tough situation, even though I still care about this person, I'm happier than I was before. So, yeah. Yeah, I just feel like you broke free of this situation here because I feel like you felt trapped. Yeah, you felt like you were wasting your time here. So, Libra, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.